What's up guys, how you guys doing today? Hope you guys are having a great day. This video won't be um, really over a whole lot of like flipping or anything like that. Um, it's only gonna be a little bit more motivational driven. Uh, and it's kind of gonna go over, you know, especially today for me. So, um, you know those days where you just wake up and you have no motivation to do anything, right? Well, that's today for me, right? However, um, you know, I make sure that I keep doing things every day because on the days where you don't want to do anything, like if you don't want to move that day, right, that's the day you need to move, right? And I'm a little sick too. Uh, I've been sick probably for the past week, but I don't participate in sickness. Like I'm not a willing, a willing participant when it comes to being sick, right? Um, like, okay, cool. I got a little, you know, a little congestion. I'm not going to lay in bed. Right, I'm not going to willingly allow myself to be sick. I'm going to get over it. I know this, right? It's a mindset thing, because um, I know I'm going to get over it. Right? I work out. I do things. I keep myself healthy. Um, I'm going to get over it, and I, I'm not a willing participant when it comes to that. Right? So I want you guys to remember that. That's important. Um, never be a willing participant when it comes to being sick. Fight it. Right. Um, but guys, whenever you don't want to move, that's when you should move the most, right? Uh, like today, guys, like I wrote down my five critical tasks today. Um, it was the answer to the phones, right? Um, but I um, am working on a new ebook specifically for uh, service-based local businesses since I've been helping out a lot of those and it's just something that's been on my mind. Uh, so I figured I'd just start building it out, right? And then uh, 30 minutes of building my funnel for that ebook. I gotta make a YouTube video today, which is what I'm doing right now, right? Um, I'm gonna stop at a pawn shop today. Um, I'm just gonna hang out and see what they got, see if I can buy anything, uh, and then also make connections, obviously. And then I gotta make some resale deck templates. Uh, so those are my five critical tasks, along with everything else that I gotta do. But the, the point of this, guys, is like, when you don't feel like moving, like I even woke up late today. I woke up at 11 a.m. Like, that's very abnormal for me, so my day got started really late, right? But and I did not want to move. I was so sore because, uh, you know, I've been working out for an hour and a half per day here recently, and I'm sore. I'm very sore, uh, and I just didn't want to move. Uh, but I was telling my students the other day, um, guys, you can't rely on motivation. Motivation will screw you over every time. Because the morning you wake up and you're like, oh, I got no motivation, right? That's when you start failing because motivation is not what allows you to do things. Motivation isn't the key factor there. It's not even close. Uh, one of my mentors says, uh, you know, discipline is the gas where motivation is the nitrous, right? So what you're really looking for instead of motivation is discipline, okay? And you have to allow yourself to be trained by discipline, right? Everything that I'm doing right here, my journaling, my five critical tasks, all of that stuff um, is, trust me, I didn't want to do it this morning. I didn't want to journal this morning. I, one of the main reasons I didn't want to journal this morning is because I had no motivation. I was just like, I don't want to do this. But as soon as I did it, the motivation was there, right? Like the motivation started as I started writing things down, as I started answering them, the morning routine questions, the morning mindset questions that, that are in this little book. By the way, guys, um, this is a pretty awesome book that I have. Uh, as you can see here, it's pretty cool. It's got the morning motivational stuff and then my five critical, critical tasks. It's also got the daily planner, which I still got to fill out today. Um, but like I said, I woke up at 11 AM, but, uh, this one is called the, uh, the high performance planner. Um, I use this daily. It's very nice because it has an evening mindset and then an evening journal. Um, and then you can really assess, kind of do like a little progress report on your day. And it's really, really nice. Um, but yeah, it's called the uh, it's called the High Performance Planner. It is on Amazon, so you guys can check it out. But that's what I use um, to kind of keep my day in order and things like that. But back to what I was saying, guys, is like when you don't feel like moving, that's when you should move the most, Okay. And allow yourself to be trained by discipline. And I want to explain that that part really quickly. Allowing yourself to be trained by discipline is different than training yourself to have discipline. Okay? Because you do – discipline is already there. It's already a thing. It's like an immutable fact 
of what life is. Discipline is discipline, right? So you you have to willingly participate in allowing yourself to be trained by discipline, okay? It's a different way of thinking, um, and it, it will take a long time to actually figure it out. Uh, that way you internalize it in your brain, you internalize it in your heart and your body, right? A good way to do this, a good way to be trained by discipline, I'll be honest with you guys, is by working out. Um, also, working out has way more benefits than just building muscle. I'm just going to be real with you guys. Um, like sometimes if I get really upset about something or I'm in an emotional state or, um, and I'm starting to realize these things as I get older, like I can tell kind of what state I'm in, um, and I can actualize it in my brain and, and I'll be like, okay, I need to go work out because what it does is it allows me to have an outlet. Um, and it works really well, but working out in general, uh, is allowing yourself to be trained by discipline. That's just, you know, what it is. Um, so allow yourself to be trained by discipline. When you don't feel like moving, that's when you should move the most, okay? If you don't want to take phone calls for your business or you don't want to answer those messages, answer the messages because, guys, there's been so many times where I don't want to take calls, I don't want to do messages, and then I haven't because I wasn't allowing myself to be trained by discipline in that in that instance, and I failed essentially, Um and I, you know, I'm not a perfect business owner, right? And nobody's perfect, right? Um, but the days that I have forced myself, not forced myself, but allowed myself to answer those phone calls, to answer those messages are the days that I've made money. And if I, if I would have just, you know, listened to my, my, uh, my brain in that instance, that emotional state, I wouldn't have made money that day. It just wouldn't have happened, Right. Uh, so allow yourself to be, you know, trained by discipline and, um, you know, allow it to take you to the next level. Um, that's really all I wanted to say today. I wanted to keep it short, but, um, I hope you guys have a good day. This is something that was on my brain today. It was on my heart and guys, I'll be honest with you this morning. I did not want to get up. You can still see I'm tired. Like I look tired, right? But I'm about to go work out. So I'll be in a pretty chipper spirit afterwards. But, um, Yeah. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Let me know what you guys thought of this video in the comments. I'd really appreciate it. Uh, and if you guys want me to make more videos like this, you know, uh, you know, put that in the comments too. I'd appreciate it. So anyway, guys, have a great day. Keep making money. And uh, allow yourself to be trained by discipline.